Hey, I'm Dr. Donald DeFabio, and it's a great day to talk relevant rehab. Thanks for tuning in. We're going to talk about sagittal plane alignment today. What does that mean? That means being tall, being strong, and not being out here, okay? So Mike's with me as always. Mike, say hi to everybody. Hi. So come on over here. We're going to use this chart so you can see it, all right? Face the wall, Mike, all right? So sagittal plane alignment means that the line going through the ear, into the shoulder, into the hip, that plumb line is square and it's straight. If there's an imbalance in the sagittal plane, he'll be leaning forward. And you can watch this line on the, on the chart behind him. And the lean can be from the feet, right? Just lean forward like that. It could be just the heads going forward. It could be the shoulders are rounded forward. Sometimes, when I lean back, stand up tall, lean back, it could be this way. That's an imbalance in the sagittal plane. Any of those things, the front to back, the sagittal plane is this plane, like I were to slice them in half this way. Any imbalances to the front or to the back are going to throw off not only your physical balance, it's going to make your body work harder, and it's going to be a very weak biomechanical posture. A very strong biomechanical posture is in neutral, having gravity just maintain a nice plumb line, and that's what we're going to talk about. Most of the problems we see are rounding of the showers and heads forward, okay? Why? Because of driving, show me driving, Mike. Show me texting, show me typing. Okay, that's why. So how do we fix that? First is bring the chin in a little bit, lift the chest up. You see how he instinctively lifted the chest? That was perfect, okay? And then you drop the shoulders down. So how we train that is by engaging, turn your back to the camera, Mike. Mm -hmm. These muscles here, because if you pull these muscles down, it relaxes the upper trap and the chest pops up, okay? So a nice exercise to do that, uh, face me, is uh, we'll use our CLX band, put your hand in the loops, um, and we'll do some burgers exercises. In fact, I'm just gonna show you two quick exercises. Go to my posture playlist, they're all in there. The key is to get the chest up, get the chin retracted a little bit so the ear's over the shoulder, and pinch here, and then you can turn out, all right? And you can do an extension too, and really, uh, um, um, and exactly. Now, he's, that's the key, all right? Now you, you don't wanna just watch the, uh, the stretch band. And then you can do the same thing with a seated row. I'm gonna take my CLX anchor, slide it in here. I'll be the door anchor, Mike. And then I'll pretend I'll just lock that in the door. I'll move out a little bit. And let's do a squat to row. All right, so you do a little bit of a squat, chin's nice and tall, and then a row, okay? And keeping the chin in and really pinching those shoulder blades. Again, you can watch the other videos on posture correction, but sagittal plane alignment is all about getting here. Then we can talk coronal plane alignment, frontal plane rather, alignment next time. Great for your scoliosis uh, people as well. I'm Dr. Donald DeFavre, it's been a great day to talk tall, strong posture, and relevant rehab. Thanks for tuning in, and please like and share our videos.